Bus, it's been a long time. Hey, what's up, Elena? How you been? Someone told me you were working out here. The foreman seems to think you're doing a pretty good job. Oh, don't let me interrupt your game. Oh, hey, thanks. You're too kind. <laughs> you still look like you're in shape. But I heard you retired. I suppose even legends of the ring like you can't beat time. <laughs> I just stepped aside to give the kids a chance. I'm as good as I ever was. That's <laughs> Well, well. I thought I'd found a quiet spot to be alone. But then two old friends had to show up. Hey, Bass. Didn't you quit? That's a shame. I thought a stud like you still had some fight left in him. <sighs> And Christy, what brings you here? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? I came on a search. I'm looking for a real man. Get ready, fight! to see you again. Tell me, how is your mother Miyako doing? You're living together in Tokyo, aren't you? Yes. But she told me she had to take a business trip out on a ship somewhere. Is that so? Well, as the head of Doa Tech Japan, she has a lot of responsibilities, you know. Uh, huh? Yeah, I suppose. To be honest, I really wouldn't know about any of that. She... never talks about her work. So... Elena... I, uh... I wanted to know about your father. What kind of man was he? <laughs> <laughs> he was a good father. A kind man. Yes. Just as I'm sure your father was, Gokuro. Oh. Maybe that's so. I don't remember my father. Kokoro. I am sure you have grown quite strong. Care to show me?
the bells of good fortune ring. are you doing here? Hello, ma'am. We, uh, came to inspect the facility. Without my permission? What is the meaning of this? <laughs> you really want to fight this badly? Face your fate. Get ready, fight! I hear you guys aren't fighting in a tournament, huh? Uh, <laughs> whatever. So, what else is new? Oh, they've been fixing up the stadium for that tournament, so, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's gonna look real good. That is, if they can finish everything up in time. <laughs> I hope you didn't bring us all the way here to talk about that. Huh? No, man, are you kidding me? No, uh, of course not. It's actually, uh, well, Ellen has been talking about this thing called mist. Hmm? Mist? Yeah, that's right. I said mist. So, uh... <laughs> actually, I don't know anything about it. <laughs> oh, jeez. If you're that clueless, just shut up. Busa is already here. Please come with me. I will tell you everything I know. Clone number 152. Alpha-152, its combat capabilities had been honed to perfection. It was time to enter the next phase of implementation. What next phase? Phase 4. Development and mass production of the perfect soldier. You see, Donovan's... No, Doatec's key profit partners were the militaries of the world's dominant nations. Prophets? That's what this was all about? That's what they were using our clan for? Elena is Doatek now, and I'm sure she'll take responsibility. Remember, it was she who tried to destroy the company when she saw what Donovan had turned it into. Yes. I wanted to be rid of it all, Doatek. Donovan, Project Alpha, everything. But Donovan created a new organization called MIST. He was determined to continue Project Alpha. Yes. In fact, 
It's possible Mist existed for years inside Doetek without a formal name. And? What else can you tell us? As you can see, Doetek maintains independent resource production facilities all over the globe. At one of them in particular, there have been some strange comings and goings. Donovan's pet assassin, Chrissy, Miyako, head of Doatek Japan, and Lisa Hamilton. She was the one who used you as a guinea pig for Project Epsilon. Lisa is also in contact with Mist. She is. We suspect that she knows everything about Mist. The location of Alpha 152. Which is why I told Kasumi where she was in the first place. And Kasumi went to that facility? Yes, that's right. There's something hidden there, I know it. I can't appear to do anything unusual, but I've made arrangements to slip you in under the radar. You, Ayane, let's go. Do you feel it as well? Yes. Only faintly, but something's definitely wrong. Discover her real intentions. Find the truth. Ayane, it's up to you. Sir. Why would she do something like this? Ah, finally the ninja decided to show their faces. But you'll be leaving empty-handed. The mark is mine. Done. No, you won't find one of them here. My mark is the other one. I shouldn't have fought. I hadn't healed yet. I've already scouted this facility. I'll show you the way. Follow me. Okay, my mark is all yours now. No more words. Face me. Get ready, fight!
Ayane, now! <laughs> Move quickly, Ayane. Sir. She was burdened with a cruel fate, but hers was still a life like any other. Donovan, why have you brought us all together here, and what on earth are you trying to achieve? This is as far as I go. You finish this. Hmm. You took your time. I've been waiting. Come on. Show me some real Mugen Tenshin. <laughs> Get ready, fight!
Master Hayate's. <laughs> it is fate. A messenger just came by. Thank you for everything, Muramasa. <laughs> Don't mention it. It's nothing, my dear. Now, go on. Stop right there. I can't let you go any further. Then I'll just fight my way through. Get ready, fight! Activating it! 
Who's doing this? It's you. But... Why would you do this? It's not like that. This is a relic from Project Epsilon. In fact, I think I can get him out of there. Master Hayate! Listen to me. Hayate has been put to sleep at a basic cellular level. But he's okay. Everything's fine. I've entered the override code. It might take a while, but he'll wake up soon. Such selfish arrogance. I cannot allow this! Get ready, fight! Good. You're back with us.
Victor Donovan. I will fight on. And I will defeat you. I just wanna drool love and drool love and groove. If and if it brings me pain, gives me walls I woo. I just wanna real. Never show you weakness, get bashed for something you may have uttered He's hungry, cannot wanna hit me like a breast so blooded Still struggling for the time, truly wanna get at me cluttered This dead or alive, what would you do? Would you let the other one scoop you run? A one who's used to prude? I won't bow down, no one can stop me It's mostly my battle against my own shadow I kept on stepping up my game of skills to get the hell out of same current endurance and we just weren't on the same page Your arguments became way too recurrent Love is power, however, let alone it turn sour Cause we kept missing out of what just got shallow every hour No other way to it, just don't fade No will not fade, no will not lose We so won't will not let anything get in my path I just wanna yeah. try My nerves are try to steer correctly, fulfill tasks collectively, basically peel the skin of fruits effectively, a bit excessively. Destiny a little bit, but painting my life aesthetically, cutting the years of maybe life and go did distressingly. Hey, I'm living it vividly. I try to live it the way I live it. Gotta be killing it if I want to be dead. Sometimes it's not just voices, more determination to score for the opportunity from next door. Hate is deplore, my thoughts, my actions I ignore. My faith is way too strong for them, I still stand tall. The day I lose to myself is the death of me, which means day I stop is the day I die deliberately. Still won't bow down to you or to me. Myself.
Did you locate the samples? Yeah. The results were even better than we thought. Then phase four is... ready to proceed? Don't sweat it, Dad. Everything's going down exactly like we planned it. <laughs>